So we're in the 3D environment of Rivet 2014 and we're going to go to our massing and sight ribbon in place mass and we're going to create a helix. We don't have a helix tool in Rivet so we have to create one manually. I'm going to start with a reference line. I'm going to draw a reference line 5 meters long. Then I'm going to model and start end arc, snapping to the two points of my reference line. That's going to set the path for my helix. I'm going to set my work plane now to be in elevation to the front view. Grab a circle and I'm going to model a circle at 400 radius on both ends. In the front view now, I'm going to take this circle and I'm going to move it up 3 meters. I can now select both profiles and the path and I'm going to create a solid form. That creates the first half of our helix. I'll remove the reference line for the minute and I'm going to go to the top view. I'm going to select this half of the helix and I'm going to copy it snapping to the end here and I'm going to rotate it 180 degrees. If I go to my front view now, you'll see that I've created both halves, but I need to place the second half in the correct location. So I'm going to select this element and I'm going to move it so the face aligns like so. And now I'm going to copy both objects and I'm going to repeat them a few times. So we can see our shape a little bit more clearly. I'm just going to apply the default form. And that is our completed helix. Thanks for watching.